Hello Internet, this is EJ with a lesson for you all. Today I'm going to give you a view inside of my brain. Scary. Let me explain that. Uh, most of us probably have tried to, to copy other players. Um, and what I do when I find a line that interests me, um, I, I figure out what is happening. So, as an example, uh, tune in G and you, you hear somebody play. Okay, that's 13th or 6th chromatic to 5. And I would take that concept 13 chromatic to 5 to other chords. So, on the G, on the C, maybe on the D, back to the G. So that's one little concept that gives you a lot of stuff and, and, and music. Uh, so what I'm going to do today, I'm going to play a solo on the Days of Wine and Roses and I picked that tune because there's a lot of uh, changes in there that are, that are standard for jazz. Um, in the upper left, co uh, left corner, <laughs> uh, you're going to see how I analyze the chords. So what's the function of the chord in the tune? In the right <laughs> corner for the viewers. Um, you're gonna see what I'm thinking. Uh, so maybe uh, the actual chord is a G, but maybe I'm playing a D minor in, in my mind. Um, and also I'm gonna put a small hint of the activity um, and 13 to five is an example of an activity. Uh, what I was doing, uh, hoping that it inspires you, inspires you all to, to take one concept maybe and, and 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 study that further okay i'm gonna start the machine play a little solo and enjoy have fun see you later mm -hmm. 